universal opens a world of opportunity enriching the broadband pioneering broadband communications partners Shin Satellite Public Company Limited, Asia's premier satellite operator, is now broadening the region's communications horizon. Building on our extensive experience of operating three TICOM communication satellites, offering services to over 40 countries on four continents, to provide the most innovative broadband satellite technology in the industry. IP Star. User terminal installation and setup for IP Star service requires the following equipments. One. Offset paraboloidal KU band dish antenna with diameter 1.2 meter. 2. Triple leg support for keeping the feed system assembly in correct position. 3. The junction block for holding the feed system. 4. OMT feed system assembly including the feed horn, the buck and the LNB. 5. Mount assembly for mounting the dish vertically into the pole stand. 6. The stand assembly comprising of the cross stands, the pole stand and the side stands for supporting the dish. 7. High performance duplex professional series IPX5100 UT with fast Ethernet and USB interface as indoor unit. 8. Components like Compass or Inclometer for finding the exact satellite location, Water level controller or Pendulum. RG6 coaxial cables for transmission or reception. RJ45 UTP cross cable for connecting to LAN. Feed through connector for RG6 coaxial cable. Cross connector for RJ45 LAN cable. RJ45 trimmer. F type trimmer, a set of screw drivers, cutter, tape, and various ranges ranging from number 10 to 13. UT Site Survey Select a proper location to install the UT. Selection of a proper location will save time and help in easy maintenance. The location should be free of buildings, trees or other obstructing media to receive proper signal. Exact satellite location should be determined by compass or inclinometer. UT setup requires the following steps. Fix the cross stand assembly. Place the cross stand assembly over the inverted pole stand. Then fasten 
four supporting stands from the central pole stands to the four ends of the cross stands. The stand assembly should be diagonally fixed to the four points of the concrete properly to ensure basal uniformity. The stand assembly should be fastened to the base tightly making the system stable. The water level controller or pendulum should be used to confirm that the pole stand is perpendicular to the bottom cross stand and base. The level of water in water level controller should be uniform from either ends. Tighten all the screws to the stand assembly completely to make the system secure and stable. The mount assembly should be fixed by four screws to the reflector. Now deploy the reflector antenna to the pole stand by vertical mount assembly. Triple leg support for keeping the feed system assembly in correct position. Place the feed system assembly to the junction block and screw it to the latter. On horizontal plane, the compass gives the azimuth angle with default azimuth angle for Bangkok 120 degree. On vertical plane, the inclinometer gives the elevation angle with default elevation angle for Bangkok 62 degree. Generally, the default polarization angle of Bangkok is like a 4 o'clock position of a watch. After this, connect the attenuator to the SAT T export of UT. However, all models do not have an external attenuator. FGCB model having series starting with RN and LN do not require an external attenuator at all because they transmit a very low power. PSCB M3 model series starting with PBE, 55 and PCA have an inbuilt attenuator inside the UT. For 10 meter reference cable method, connect one cable from the back output to the attenuator output port. Connect other cable from the LNB to the SAT RX port of the UT. Directly connect the UTP cross cable from the LAN port to the user PC or notebook. Connect the AC power supply of the UT and switch on the power. 